all by herself. Police tell us he's done the same thing before, and we've reported on it. A few weeks ago, we told you about the man after he allegedly left a 20 month old strapped in a car seat when he went inside a local gym. And now today, police telling us it happened again, this time at a Salisbury auto dealership. NBC Charlotte's Rad Berkey has been in Salisbury today talking to his mother and neighbors who were upset to hear what had happened. When Salisbury police got the call that a child had been found alone in a car, it didn't take them long to figure out it wasn't the first time. Police found the child in an SUV that had been brought into this Ford dealership for repairs. Inside the dealership, investigators say they arrested 30-year-old Kyan Hyjin, who also calls himself Jeffrey Robeson, and charged him with child abuse. How are you? I'm Rad Berkey. When we went to his house today, his mother, Bertha Mae Hairston, answered the door but would not come outside. What happened? Did he just forget? He just forgot. That's all. But that's not all. In fact, police say the same kind of thing happened before when they say Hi Jin left the girl in his car while he went inside a gym to work out. This is the second time this has happened. Uh, how, 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 how can that happen twice? I don't know. I don't want to talk about it. But neighbors did want to talk about it. You're surprised to hear this? Well, yeah, I was surprised on both issues the first time and the second time. I just think it's wrong. There's too many children dying, being left in cars. While the little girl in this case is okay, the AAA reports five children have died this year after being left in a vehicle, and summer hasn't even started. Okay, if you don't want your child, please give it to somebody who does. Hai Jin will remain free until June the 6th. That's when he goes to court to answer the charge of child abuse. In Salisbury, Rad Berkey, NBC Charlotte. Now to some breaking news, a police officer shoots a man at a South Carolina Walmart after that man allegedly shot a customer. This